One command I use often on walks, both on leash and off leash, is the back command. I pretty much use it interchangeably with heel, although there are some subtle differences. I use heel differently than most trainers do. It doesn't mean my dog needs to stay on a particular side. It just means he has to be behind me. His nose has to be behind the front of my leg and walking at my side. That's what I do for a heel. And if he's out in front of me, I'll say Bruno heel. It means he has to wait for me to pass him and then stay behind me. Now, if he starts inching forward when he's in a heel, then I use the back command. No distractions at all. If you don't have good off-leash recall, don't try this out where there's distractions or even in the backyard. Start off in your living room or your hallway. And once you're really confident he knows what it means and he listens to it, then you can move into the backyard where there might be a few more distractions and practice off-leash there. Here's a clip where I show how I start training this. Let's go. Back. Good boy. This way. Let's go. Back. Good boy. It's a little tough to tell in this clip, but notice the sequence that I follow. I start walking, I say, let's go. As his nose gets up to the back of my leg, I put my hand out and say, back. When he backs off, I immediately praise. Here it is again. Let's go. Back. Good boy. This way. Let's go. Back. Good boy. If he didn't stop moving forward or back off as soon as I gave the command, I would have had to give an audible correction. I didn't have to in this case. The default when I'm walking with my dog is he needs to be, his nose needs to be, be behind the front of my leg. That's the default position. There are other commands I use, and I'll give those in a separate video, but the back command I use quite a bit. One other situation where I use this command is when I go out the door to put my shoes on on my front porch, I don't say anything to Bruno. I just swing the door open, walk out. Every now and then, he'll take the bait, and he'll take one step outside the door, and I say, no back. And then I praise him. Most of the time, he will not go out that door without a release. But in those cases where he tries, I use the back command.